Tonight, we often think of U.S. Marshals as hunting for fugitives, but we're learning they also search for missing and endangered children, and they're pretty good at it. It's a new initiative that's getting results. Jacqueline Francis joins us live tonight with more on the operation that rescued more than two dozen children. Jacqueline. Yeah, this is not what the U.S. Marshal Service is known for, but it's work they're proud to do. Their latest operation spanned 10 weeks, during which time 25 Metro Detroit kids were safely found. Hey, I got a runner out of the vehicle. Uh, she's heading back towards the main drag. It's called Operation We Will Find You, and it's true to its name. The U.S. Marshal Service searching not for fugitives, but for missing and endangered kids. Generally a new mission for us. So from the Justice for Victims of Trafficking Act, uh, this gave us statutory authority to conduct missing child operations and assist state and locals without there having to be a sex offender nexus to it. In its first 10 week operation, more than 225 kids were found nationwide, 25 of them in Metro Detroit. In addition to other local kids who were located by U.S. Marshals, but deemed okay to stay where they were. I have a daughter same age as you. So that just shows you how important it is. Not dealing with a, a fugitive, you're dealing with a victim. So you want to make sure that you're treating them in a way that they know that someone cares. She's right in front of my unit. Okay. Turn around, man, so she can get her, get her. Uh, During the operation, the Detroit area marshals found kids in unsettling places, some involved in trafficking. Pretty rough. Um, some kids were living in cars. Um, some kids were living in abandoned houses. The marshals work closely with Child Protective Services, as returning home isn't always a safe option. This was a multi-agency operation. The U.S. Marshal Service is looking forward to continuing these efforts. Reporting live in Detroit, Jacqueline Francis, Local 4. Really great that it's working. Jacqueline, thank you.